Ladies and gents, welcome back. I just wanted to put this one out here real quick. This is a new docu-series that's free to watch that you guys can all go check out. It's uh, at the truckingforfreedom.com website. Trucking for Freedom is a docu-series built by Canadian creatives. I watched this last night and enjoyed it thoroughly. And this is why I'm making this video. I want to recommend everybody go over and watch. So episode one is out. It came out yesterday. And it's uh, really, really well done. Um, we have a countdown here, 43 days until the next installment. But we can we can uh, have a look at the trailer here. Really quick. The decision about whether or not to declare a public health emergency of international concern is one I take extremely seriously and one I'm only prepared to make with appropriate consideration of all the evidence. That was what, what it was. It was trying to buy us time is where that two weeks to flatten the curve came from. <laughs> It was a sincere effort to try to save lives or prevent deaths. They had actually shut everything down. And I was like, whoa, what's going on here? But honestly, I, I thought it would be temporary. I didn't think it was gonna be anything sustainable. The idea of locking everybody down for two years you know, that's not part of any response plan. They're going to kill the very businesses that we depend on to keep the economy going. And the truckers, they didn't say, we're going to go to Ottawa and demand that we're allowed to travel again across the border. They didn't go there for themselves. They went there for all of us. You know, this is this is where it gets gets really interesting. It's so heartwarming. Like you really need to watch this because there is so much in this uh, episode, this particular episode, that you even forget about what happened. Uh, during during the course of all of this unfolding in front of all of us, uh, a lot of a lot of stuff. I was like, oh yeah, I can't. I I, for, I almost completely forgot that these things happened. And this is why these documentaries are important because we can go back and and recollect all of this information uh, that was that was shot at us in in such quick succession in order to get us to give up so many of our civil liberties in in this whole fight now um this this first part is the how we how we got there so it doesn't really get so much into what was going on at the convoy but what was leading up to the convoy and why people started this convoy and it you really need to watch it i really re can't recommend it anymore go into the description down below i'll have a link for the website you can watch it for free uh, recommend donating to them. I believe I'm going to be donating to them myself because I'd want to see I want to see more work like this. Now, how we got here for 33 days, the world watched across 10 crossing 10 provinces and three territories. Thousands of trucks traversed the highways and byways of Canada's northern climes in the exclusive documentary offering an immersive look into extraordinary movement in Canadian history. The Chronicle brothers embedded themselves in the Canadian trucker convoy, capturing the unifying pulse of everyday people. The directors blend interviews, the live, uh, in, sorry, blend, the directors blend interviews and live footage, journaling unbiased truths intrinsically viewed through the camera lens. They expose raw emotion and purpose of those who felt compelled to embark on a jury journey fraught with both joy and sorrow. The film lays bare a deep, broadening divide within a country known for unity and trust, and how two years of lockdowns illuminated the disparity of the working class 
and the political landscape. It drives, it gives a raw and unpolished visual of diverse Canadians holding gutted Canadian charter up to the spotlight and hoping to be heard. What is the film about? It's our goal is simple. We traveled with the Freedom Convoy to document first person eyewitness accounts. Our team is documenting, producing, sharing the story of Freedom Convoy. Please go check this website out. Go this evening when you've got nothing to do and you're hanging out and make yourself a bowl of popcorn. It's really well done. It's um, I believe it's about 50 minutes in length. It's not super long. But uh, yeah, give up. Give up whatever crappy show you're going to watch on Netflix and watch this. You definitely guarantee that it won't be time wasted. And make sure you share it out there. Get more people's eyes on this because it's important that we all see this. Anyway, we'll see you in the next video. Talk to you later. Leave a comment in the comment section down below. Subscribe if you're not subscribed. Keep on trucking.